This DVD has been put together to give you information about the NHS screening programme for bowel cancer that's being established across the country. Cheshire and Merseyside was one of the first areas to begin screening and the programme will be national by 2009. The programme aims to save lives by early detection of cancer and by the detection and removal of bowel polyps that might otherwise become cancerous. This early detection is done by testing samples of bowel motion for hidden traces of blood. The risk of bowel cancer increases with age, so the screening program is aimed at those aged between 60 and 69. If you're over 69 and would like to be screened, or if you need information about bowel cancer screening in another language or format, or if you simply want advice, call the free helpline number shown on the screen. There are three stages to the screening programme. The first is the letter inviting you to take part. This letter contains important information about your suitability for screening. Some people may not need screening if, for example, they are already being treated for certain bowel conditions, so please read your letter carefully. The second stage is the screening kit, which you will receive by post a week after your invitation letter. The screening kit is designed to be done in the privacy of your own home. It contains a general information leaflet, a patient instruction leaflet, six sample sticks, the screening kit and a foil lined prepaid envelope. In order to complete the second stage, it is necessary to collect three samples of bowel motion on separate days within two weeks. The best way to collect a bowel sample is to use a clean plastic container. As this is a demonstration, I'm using a brown paste. You'll need your sample, the sample sticks, and the test strip to hand. Open the first tab of the strip. Then using one of the cardboard sticks, take a small amount from your sample and smear it onto the test area marked one under the first tab. Then using a fresh stick, take another small amount from a different part of the sample and smear this onto the next area marked 2 under the first tab. Repeat this process two more times on separate days, remembering to use fresh sample sticks each time and again recording each date. When you have completed the third sample, place the screening test strip in the prepaid foil envelope and put it in the post. The third stage of the screening programme takes place when your screening test strip arrives at the laboratory. Here, the six sample areas are tested for hidden traces of blood. You will receive the results by post. There are three possible results. Negative, which is normal, meaning that no traces of blood were found in any of the six sample squares. Abnormal, which means that blood was found in all of them. And unclear, which means that some traces of blood were found. What happens next depends on your test results. If it's normal, you'll be invited for rescreening every two years until you reach the age of 69, and after that, by request. If it's unclear, we'll send you another screening test kit. It's very important that you correctly complete this, as sometimes it's necessary to complete more than one additional kit before we can confirm your result. If your result is abnormal, we will invite you to attend a clinic for further tests. To reduce anxiety, this usually takes place within two weeks of getting your test result. There are many possible reasons for an abnormal result and the specialist nurse will be able to advise you. 
procedure lasts about half an hour. You will probably have a colonoscopy, which is an examination of the bowel. And if a polyp is discovered, it will probably be removed at that time. Remember, bowel cancer screening saves lives. So, when your kit arrives, use it and return it. It's worth remembering that even though the NHS is planning to extend bowel cancer screening to people up to the age of 75 by 2010, you should be aware of the signs and symptoms for bowel cancer at any age. Signs and symptoms to watch out for include bleeding from the rectum or back passage, tiredness, change of bowel habit, pain or lump in the abdomen, unplanned weight loss, unexplained loss of appetite, nausea or feelings of sickness. If you've experienced any of these symptoms that have lasted between four and six weeks, it's important to see your doctor. And please remember the importance of regular hand washing.